Well, boys, it's another busy day out in the farm, and we got so much stuff to do. It, it's actually ridiculous, but uh, today we got to finish harvest, and then I think the corn is ready to go to get uh, chopped into silage. So hopefully I can figure out how to run this thing properly. I don't know how that's going to go, but we're going to hop in the semi here and get going out to the field. Anyways, we're supposed to get rain this week, so I'm going to try to get everything that I possibly can done before that, hopefully, because I think we're already a little behind on harvest here, so we got to get rolling. All right, so this is our next field here, and since I don't have anybody to pick me up i gotta go and run over to the combine myself that's gonna be fun i'm thinking we won't really need the grain cart because the field's not that big so i can just dump it into the semi i guess let's hope i can get down the road here this header is awful wide well we made it that wasn't a very long drive but we made it i think i still got everything set correct on the combine so shouldn't have to adjust any of that i know somebody commented on the last video uh the header is is a little big for the combine and uh they're right they're right about that but you know what Go big or go home. It still kind of works. I really just need a header trailer for it, and then we'll be a lot better off trying to get this down the road. Well, everything seems to be going good so far. Uh, the field is yielding not too bad, so we should get this off in no time. I think this actually may be one of our smallest fields. I'm not entirely sure. I don't even think we're going to get a full tank off of this, to be honest. It is looking like we might get... 75% something like that not too much just on the last little bit of this field here we'll get this finished off dump it in the trailer and then we'll head over to the next section there get that done and then I think we'll be pretty much done harvest as far as beans go this year and the combine definitely needs a wash this thing is looking dirty now it's pretty dang close with my prediction of about 75% we got 72% so not horrible but not great. All right, on to the next set of fields. Okay, so I got everything moved over here to the next field. I had to uh, bring the service truck over here because needed to wash the windows. I didn't have the squeegee and anything with me to uh, do that, so that was all in the service truck. Anyway, windows are slightly more clean here, so I can actually see what I'm doing a little bit. Didn't do the best job here because we're almost finished. But yeah, that last field there was the smallest field we had. This one is just a tad bit bigger though. Oh, it looks like somebody already got to one of their fields here. I think one of my neighbors owns this one. Actually, scratch that. He does own that one. And apparently he's looking to downsize a little bit and he might want to lease out some ground for next year. So maybe we can get this big piece here. Actually, all the surrounding pieces here I think he owns. So that might be a pretty sweet deal if we could get this entire chunk. Oh, I'm missing some. I'll have to go back for that one. But yeah, if we can get this entire chunk, that would be awesome. Well, we're getting closer here. This field is not taking long at all, as I expected. But everything seems to be dried out real nice, so at least we're not getting stuck this time around. Next year may be a different story, though. Who knows? And that is a wrap on bean harvest. Finished up. Well, I'm gonna get this dumped. We'll get everything back to the farm here, and then if there's still enough daylight left, we're gonna try to get on silage here, which I'm thinking there should be silage shouldn't take too long although there's quite a bit of land back behind the farm there so who knows all right time to try get this back to the farm without hitting anything the deer would just get out of the dang road we might be a little better off here now let's see if we can get this big thing through the yard actually you know what we might just stick it right here for now probably be a better place for it then it's kind of out of the way well everything's back at the farm now or am i gonna park the semi here we'll just park it around back because i'm sure we're gonna have to move stuff around in the next little while here i'm gonna have to do harvest cleanup another day because we got way too much to do right now but hopefully i can get it done sometime this week i think but my neighbor just called the guy that i was supposed to go bale hay for like way earlier this year they said he wants to do his uh, little hay field back at his house which is literally right across the road from us so better late than never i suppose but now we got even more to do anyways while well, we still got daylight left here i think we're gonna try get a little bit of salvage done and see how that goes I just gotta see if I can figure out how to run this thing. Pretty sure I got a good idea of it though. Okay, I think everything's on. I think everything's good here. I think we're going. This corn is flipping tall. Oh man. We're gonna be getting a lot of silage out of this. Okay, so we made it to one of the other fields back here. I think I'm just gonna try and cut a path all the way back because I know there's another field or two just so we can get all the way back here for now. Yeah, there's a little more space back here at least. I think if we can, I'll just try polish off these two small fields back here. I don't know if we'll get them all in the wagon, but we can sure as heck try. Then we'll just work our way forward. Well, we got the first small field done back here. There's one more small one back here. I don't know if we're gonna fit it in the cart, but we'll try our best. We are slowly running out of daylight though. That worries me a little bit. All right, we got our first full cart here, so I'm just gonna bring this to the edge of the field we'll grab a tractor take it to the neighbor's place and uh, get that unloaded this is actually working not too bad better than i thought it would we still got a little bit left back there in that one field all right that'll do it right there i think the old 4040 should do this oh yeah it's got this no 
problem. I think there may be a little something wrong with the roof on this, but nah, it'll be all right. Well, we'll get this to my neighbors, get it unloaded, and uh, head back for another. Okay, this should be the place right here. Yep, there's the silage. Uh, well, I guess silos. Looks like he's got the blower already there, and with the tractor I very, very much want, but he won't sell to me. Seems about right. Hold up. Just got to start up this old beast first. There we go. And I think we can unload now. Yep. Everything's working. I think this just takes a minute to unload. That's all. So we're going to be here a little while. Just about unloaded. This is going to be one of many, I think. Okay, back to the farm. So according to my uncle, the last time there was silage done on this farm, it was roughly... 10 years ago, which is nuts. So we're doing silage on the farm for the first time in 10 years, which is kind of cool. It's not really for us, but we're still doing it. I guess grandpa used to have a bunch of cattle, so that's what he did it for, but he kind of got rid of all of them. Maybe I'll, I'll start getting back into cattle. That just seems like a whole nother deal to start, but maybe at some point. We're just going to cut another row down here until we get to the other uh, field, and then we'll get that finished. Another field done. Two more big ones to go. I think we're going to try for a headland on this side. See how it goes. I'm keeping my eyes peeled on the sides here for, uh, you know, old trucks and tractors. You never know what grandpa stashed back here. And since I found that last truck back here, I've seen some traces of other vehicles, like random parts and such. So who knows what else is out here? Hold again. Time for another load back to the other farm. Well, boys, the cart is once again full. We got this other field finished off here, minus this one little piece here which i'm actually gonna get but i think we're gonna call it good on silaging i'll take this cart to the farm tomorrow morning and then uh, i think we'll finish off the rest of the field but for now i got a couple other things i want to do on the farm before it gets too dark it looks like i'm gonna have to get out uh, the mowing equipment again to mow that neighbor's pasture there which uh, won't take long but still gotta do it i guess i gotta get this entire shed organized before winter because there's a lot of stuff i gotta put away most of which i think i'm gonna try get in the shed or uh put in these other sheds here i still gotta clean up from harvest so there's that i gotta drag out a bunch of equipment from the back of the property there because i want to get that cleaned up before winter i gotta start working on my uh winter project there is just way too much to do i gotta clean up grandpa's car before we put it away for the winter but i figured we just whip over here and check out this little piece that i gotta mow yeah this will not take long i'm just gonna talk to the neighbor here real quick and see what we want to do about it okay so just had a quick chat with the neighbor here i'm coming to mow this tomorrow afternoon and he said in return for doing that he's gonna let me have this entire shop back here rent free where we can put equipment in it's covered it's nice so we actually get to store a bit more stuff which is perfect for the winter he doesn't use it at all so he said he was going to rent it out anyway and that just makes it easier for us so i think we'll be able to get the combine at least in there which is nice i guess and as much as i'd like to finish off the silage tonight i really don't want to be doing that in the dark the lights on that machine are not the greatest so yeah last thing i need is running into something and wrecking it and all that you know what's sad my garden I never ever got to plant it. It is just full of weeds at this point. That is just, yeah. I, oh, I forgot about these pails. I still got to take these to my uh, one neighbor there. Okay, well, more stuff to do. But I hope you all enjoyed. Subscribe and goodbye.